What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to another IRL pack opening. And today, guys, we have a uh, 2020 Mosaic Football Blaster Box, I think it's called, right? I honestly don't know. Um, I got into sports cars lately, dudes. We picked up one of these, um, and I know these packs are literally stacked, dude. Like, they're good. Um, and there's a lot of good things you can pull from these, and I'm going to see if they're worth buying today. Um, that's kind of the point of the video here. Is this if you guys want to buy these? I actually picked this up on Amazon. It was about fifty dollars, which is kind of expensive. I know you could get it at Target for like twenty, um, but Target is literally always it's gonna be always sold out, dude. So Target is just they have nothing. Um, if you guys are looking to start collecting sports cards and buying cards, highly suggest not to go to Target because usually they don't have anything unless you go on the day they restock, which you definitely never know. Um, we're going to go ahead and hop right into this though. Um, and I'm hoping to pull some good rookies. Um, I want to pull my first autograph card. That would be insane. Even a, uh, Jersey card as well would be cool. Um, in this box, you can see retail exclusives, um, for mosaic parallels and all that. Pretty cool the box itself. Um, I thought the box was going to be a lot bigger. I'm not going to lie. Um, when it came in the mail, like, this is a pretty small box. Like, it might look big for you guys, but it's pretty small. Like, my hand is, my hands are small. And look at it. It's, like, literally, that's that's a pretty small box, yeah. Um, but, yeah, um, we have eight packs with four cards in it. And we're looking to pull, like I said, a Tua, maybe. Um, I don't even know who else, man. Just some good players will be lit. Um, like I said, $50 box here, so maybe we can make some money back. Um, I'm gonna start by I I don't know how other people do it. I think they literally just like cut the plastic off from like the side. Just give me one second here. I'll cut the plastic off over here. Um, okay. Okay, we got the plastic off. Okay, here we go. Let's hop right into this. We got the plastic coming off. Making sure my hands are not wet either because I don't want to touch any of the cards with wet hands because that would literally ruin the card, especially if we pull a good card. You know, you don't want to ruin that. Um, I got the sleeves right here. I actually don't have um, individual sleeves right now. I have like the sleeve. I have a bunch of sleeves basically, but they're all stuck together kind of. I'll show you guys in a second here. I have these kind of sleeves, if you guys know what I mean, like the ones you put into a binder. I have a bunch of them here, um, which I'm going to slide everything into there when I pull them. So I just get the setup now. And we were good. Let's go ahead and hop into it. Um, where is the... I think this is the opening, right? Do I have to... Okay, there we go. The struggle is real, yeah. Let's go ahead and... Um, I don't know what this is in here. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is literally like... You can't... What, what is this? Okay. There are the packs. There should be eight packs. So I'm just going to make... I'm going to pour them out here. I'm going to make sure there's eight packs in there. Um, I don't want to mess up the cards in there, though. Um, is there eight packs? Let's see here. We got one pack here, two packs, um, three. We have four. We have five. The cards are kind of, oh my god, they're kind of bent, yo. That's annoying. I don't know if you guys can see that. That is bent. Six, seven, eight. Eight packs there. We're going to hop into it. I don't, I'm hoping they're not bent. Like, it looks like they are. That is really annoying. Okay, we're hopping into it, though. Hopefully, they're not. I don't want to rip the package and open either. Like, I, the last time I did these kind of things, I literally accidentally ripped open, like, the card itself. So definitely don't want to do that here because uh, that would piss me off uh, big time. Well, let's go ahead and um, into this first one here. A boomer. That's how you do it. I've seen so many people pull this guy, and I was hoping not to pull him. I really was. It's a pretty rare card, though. Um, not rare, but... You can see, God, the cards are bent like crazy. That is annoying. We got Zach Ertz there. Um, we have Harrison Smith. Uh, J.K. Robbins. I don't, or Dobbins, I mean, not J.K. Robbins. I think that's a pretty good pull. Uh, rookie card there. The cards are, are, like, extremely bent, dude. That is, that's annoying. So maybe, I don't know. That is, that is, that is annoying. So Amazon must have did something there with those. Um, maybe I don't think I'm gonna be able to get my money back, but maybe I'll get something out of that because the card shouldn't come in bent, dude. These packs are literally impossible to open. Um, but yeah, that is annoying because cards, they do go down in price extremely because if they're bent. And I don't know why they came in bent like this. It's like someone opened the box and, like, um, bent all the cards and put them back in. 
Um, but here we go. We have a Devin Singletary right here. Pretty cool. You guys can kind of see my me in the reflection there. My hair's all messed up right now because I took a shower. I got Marcus Mariota, if you guys can see that there. Oh, Joe Burrow rookie card. That is what we were looking for, dude. That is what we wanted. And that is like bent as hell, dude. I'm literally going to throw hands. And we got an old school Steve Young. Extremely good there. So we pulled that Joe Burrow. I'm actually going to sleeve the Joe Burrow right now. Real quick. It's it's bent like crazy, though. That's a no Bro, I'm actually kind of pissed. I don't know if you guys can tell there. Um, let's get rid of these packs so here that are opened. That is, that's annoying, yeah. Um, that they came in like that. Uh, I don't know how they got bent. Um, I, t I like, if you guys are card buyers or like when you guys open a bunch of these packs, I know there's a bunch of you guys, just let me know down below if they're supposed to come in like that. Um, if they're supposed to be bent like that, I definitely are not. Um, we got that Marcus Mariota though. We're definitely going to sleeve a bunch of these at the end, actually, because I don't want to have to go through this all right now. But, yeah, let's keep going here. We have the literally the third pack, right? We're Dude, we pulled a Joe Burrow already. I'm not complaining. Even though it's, like, the literally the most bent Joe Burrow card I've ever seen, I literally do. These packs are, like, are you kidding? They're, like, super glued shut. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, hold up. What in the world? Okay. These cards are literally super glued shut. Okay, we have a Philip Lindsay. Dude, I don't want to get my, my... I look so bad right now because my hair's all messed up. We have Philip Lindsay there. We have a Cameron Jordan right there, if you guys can see that there. Pretty decent pull. We have a Barry Sanders Hall of Fame mosaic card. That is really cool, actually. I, I do mess with Barry. And we have a Zach Ertz Philadelphia um, Eagle player right there. That's not a bad card either. Um, are these called green pair? I think they're called that. I'm not too sure. Like I said, I'm new to cards here. Um, we're going to go ahead and um, hop into the next one, which uh, honestly, I don't know if Barry Sanders goes for anything. Um, really cool card, though. Dude, the bent, the cards are so bent. That is so annoying, yeah. Um, let me quickly... I'm actually going to make a good pile of cards real quickly. The good pulls and then the bad pulls, which I think Barry Sanders is going to go on the good pulls because you know he's a he's a god. Um, and then I'm going to pull all the green mosaics, actually, in one thin as well. Dude, that is actually, um, you guys don't understand how mad I am that these came in like this. And I honestly think I should get my money back, in my opinion, for this. Um, because that is, that is definitely not what you suspect, is to order a $50 thin off of Amazon. It comes in, the cars are literally destroyed inside. They're not supposed to be like this, unless mosaics are supposed to be like this, which I, I highly doubt. I, I really don't. Um... And I don't, like, these packs, dude, why do I feel like these packs, like, someone literally glued them together? Like, hold up. Like, this is annoying. Okay. Like, holy. I can't tell, if, like, the box when it came in was also kind of, like, damaged. So I kind of noticed that off the rip. Um, but yeah. Hold up. The cards are literally, like, all stuck together in here. Whoa. Okay. Hoping we can pull a two us soon, because that'll be fire. Um, we have a Jordan Hicks right there. Really cool card right there. We have a Warren Sapp, um, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. A, whoa, we got Judy. And I know Judy is actually a good rookie card, so I, I'm pretty... That's pretty good. Honestly, I'll take that. And we got a... Um, a carry on. Is this, a, this is not a rookie card, but I don't even know who this guy is. So we got that Jerry Judy... Um, Kind of happy with that, actually. So I'll put that in the dub pile. I don't know who this guy is. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I don't watch Lion. Is, it, is he Lions? Yeah, he's Lions. Okay. Okay. We have the next one. We have about four more packs left, dude. Can we pull an autograph player? Even though the car's probably going to be absolutely destroyed. Um, and probably not going to go for any. Dude, look at, like, what? How does this happen, yeah? Okay. Um, these packs are so weird. Like, like I don't... This is so weird, bro. These packs are, like, super glued shut, yeah. I've actually, like, I feel like an idiot because I've never seen someone struggle open these packs before. And I'm literally the only one on YouTube that are probably struggling to open these. We got a Miles Garrett. We have a green mosaic coming up. Dude, my hair looks so bad right now. I'm promising you guys I don't look as bad. It's just my hair is all wet So because I just took a shower. Adrian Peterson. 
a NFL debut, Justin Jefferson. So, honestly, good rookie card there. A Roger... I, I, who is this? I Actually, Dallas Cowboys, Roger... I don't know who this is. I'm sorry. I, like, don't flame me for not knowing who this is. It's the Cowboys, though. And the Cowboys actually lost last night um, to the Steelers, which actually... The, the Steelers are a really good team. And the Cowboys actually did pretty good. So, Cowboys fans, you guys can't really be too mad, right? I'm a Jets fan, so I can't say anything because the Jets literally haven't gotten the first win yet. So, yeah. Um, which we played tonight, actually, against the Patriots, which maybe we can get our first dub, honestly. that will be sick. All right, we got a Gardner um, in Shaw, which I... Does he... I don't... A lot of people want to pull him. I don't think it's any good, though. Maybe he is. I don't know. Um, I'll put him in the dub pile, though. We got George Kittle. We got a Jordan Love. These cards are so bent. So Jordan Love's pretty decent. We got a Got Game AP. So I take that. I'll take that any day. AP is really good. Um, it's crazy how many teams he's actually gone to, yo. He's been to so many teams, and <laughs> he continues to quit, keep switching. Um, what, he's on the Redskins now? I bet next year, yo, next year, honestly, come to the Jets, yo. We need you. Big dub. Even though the Jets are terrible, I don't think any player would want to come to the Jets. Literally ruin your career, but... Okay, can we pull a jersey card, dude? I feel something. This this pack feels a little bit more um, heftier than the others, but we got Cahill Mack there. I don't know if I'm saying his name right. We got Aaron Donald. Okay, Aaron Donald I do like. That's a really cool-looking card there. A Patrick Mahomes MVP. That is a good... I think that's a good one. I honestly... Patrick Mahomes... Um, I don't know if you guys can see up here. I have, like, three Patrick Mahomes EPI... I think that's EPIX score. I'll show you guys that after. And then we have a Chris Jones. So, Patrick Mahomes is a definitely a dub, I think. And then we got Chris Jones mosaic there. Okay, so I think we just got in... We just got two Kansas Cities back-to-back, -back, actually. I just noticed that. Last pack, dude. Can we hit it big with the last pack, dude? $50 on the drain. Can we get a signature, though? If I can actually open the last pack, that'd be great. Um, okay. I literally have such a mess right here. We got Devontae Adams, MVP maybe? Of, I don't know. Uh, the best wide receiver, a lot of people are saying. We'll see. Um, we got Mike Evans, actually right after, which is cool. Um, Jonathan Taylor, which is, I think he's doing really well this season as well. And we got a will to win, Brett Favre. Not a bad pull right there. That's actually a really cool looking card. So no signatures at all. No jersey, which is still, dude, I, I got to find those, dude. Sooner or later, I got to find them. Will to win, though. Let's go ahead and go over the polls real quick. Um, so let me sleeve a couple of them up, actually. I don't know if I'm going to sleeve the Brett Farf up because is it really worth? I mean, I don't know. But let's just go over the good polls, even though the cards are literally all bent. This is... I'm, dude, I'm kind of mad. I don't know if, I mean, if you guys were in my shoes and you guys bought $50 worth of packs, basically, and they came in bent like this, I, I bet you guys would be mad, too. Especially for the, the, the card collectors out there and you guys buy these packs for videos. Um, yeah, just, it's just annoying. Um, I've, I mean, I've never bought in a booster box before, a blaster, what, dude, what is it called? Booster, blaster? I don't really know. But, yeah, let's go over the good polls, I would say. We got Jonathan Taylor there. Um, we got Mike Evans. We got... Hold up, these are all stuck together, dude. We got Devontae Adams. We got the Chris Jones mosaic. I'm definitely going to sleeve these up. Patrick Mahomes, big one, I think. Adrian Peterson. Jordan Love. Gardner Manshaw. I don't know if that's any good. Um, we got a Roger. I do. I still don't know who this is. I Just tell me down below if... I don't know. Is, is it like, tell me in the back of the garden? Um... The U.S. Yeah, the U.S. Naval Academy website. Wait, huh? So, I don't know. I I still don't know. Comment down below if he's any good. We got the NFL debut Justin Jefferson. I like that. Jerry Judy, which is actually played extremely well against my team, the Jets. He 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 marked us. Yeah. We got the J.K. Ro uh, Dobbins. Like, dude, why did he say Robbins? He, it's actually a Green Mosaic rookie card, which is cool. Barry Sanders, huge one, I would say there. And Zach Ertz, Green Mosaic. So, not the best hits, um, I would say. I mean, I don't know. Comment down below, like, if there's any... Like, I know I watch a bunch of these people that open these booster or blaster boxes. Whatever they're called, but I keep forgetting the name. Um, and they know about more pulls than me, so... 
Comment down below. Here's that Brett Favre again. But let's quickly show you guys. I'm going to, like, lit my phone off the stand for a second here. So you guys can see what I'm working with here for my cards wise. Uh, so I don't know if you guys have watched the other pack opening, the NFL score 2019. We pulled three Pat Mahomes. I, I don't know if you guys can see that or not because of the lighting. Um, but we pulled three Pat Mahomes, which is honestly, I don't know if they're any good. Um, we pulled that James Conner, Saquon Barkley, that Drew Brees, which honestly, when he retires, that card is going to go for a lot. I guarantee you. So I'm definitely going to hold on to that. I'm probably going to hold on to a bunch of these. Um, but yeah, this is literally the aftermath of this, this opening. Like this is, um, yeah, but kind of mad. Like I said, the cards are really bent. Um, you guys can definitely see that from that. Like, look at that. That's, that's pretty bent. Yeah. You know? Like that doesn't, it doesn't, you can see it doesn't sit straight. So yeah, that's going to wrap it up. If you guys want me to do another IRL pack opening like this, definitely drop a like, um, it definitely will help support me. I also forgot to show you guys the best poll of, of the video, y'all. From that Joe Burrow. I literally almost forgot. I sleeved it up already. But I'm going to go ahead and sleeve these up. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Everyone drop a like. If you guys are new, subscribe as well because that will definitely help me out. Um, yeah, maybe Joe Burrow might might have made my money back. I honestly don't know. 50 bucks, like I said. Um, if you guys are wondering if these packs are worth it or not, um, I definitely think they are still, even though I didn't pull that much good. Um, but if you guys are looking for the like, card collecting, I say these definitely have the best looks, I would say. Um, and also, just if you just go to Target. I mean, I said in the beginning, don't go to Target. But if you can get yourself a box of Target for 20 bucks, that's a steal. And if you see multiple of them, I say buy a decent amount of them. But don't be one of the people that hogs everything. You know what I mean? That's just, that's not how it works. But yeah, that's going to wrap it up. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.